Hi guys, I just did a video where I made this cardboard glider out of this cardboard box that the uh, little glider came in. And I've got enough left over, enough cardboard left over, see if I can make myself a little rubber band powered car with what's left. Have to see if I can get enough space to do some wheels because we want one, two, three. I think we'll have to have bigger back wheels and smaller front wheels. But we should be able to get four wheels out of that. Just an ordinary flat piece of card for the body. Bend that over and glue it to stiffen it a little bit. I'll do the same on the other side. Then that'll be our body. That's a handy little bit already cut out there for where the rubber bands will go around the axle. Uh, next question is what we're going to do about axle tubes. I'll have a little think. All right, for the axle tubes, I'm going to take the easy way out. I'm going to use a drinking straw. This one's a paper drinking straw. It's slightly narrower than I like. I like the ones that are a bit, a bit bigger diameter than that, but it'll do. I've got a couple of bamboo canes here, or barbecue skewers. They're a nice loose fit in there. So, bamboo canes for axles, drinking straw for the axle tubes. Got a compass, so we can draw some circles for the wheels. So, wheels. Oh, oh yeah, I, was say, I thought I had some scissors here somewhere. bits off so I've got less to move around. I'll cut the body first. That folds about two centimeters. So we're going to fold that over. That'll give it a bit more strength along the edge. I do the same on this side. We'll make it 30 centimetres long. And then whatever's left we can use for the wheels. So I'm going to fold that over. That should stiffen the body a little bit. I've got super glue. You could probably use tape. Or other, other types of glue. Just cut that 
bit off. Right, put that to one side, that's our body. Wheels. Hundred and forty. Right, we'll do hundred and forty. Diameter, so that's going to be 70 radius. smaller wheel they're going to be a little bit dished but I think they'll be okay Handy to have a few little bits of cardboard to strengthen the centre points of the middle. And you push these through. If you've got a bit on the back there, it just makes it a bit stronger if we glue it in place. our wheels, axles, body, mm -hmm. we put a 
little slot in there in the middle. Just like that, we can hook the rubber band through it. sure if we can glue these on. I'll try gluing them. If it doesn't work I'll have to tape them. I expect I'll have to tape them. Make sure they stick out just a little bit. That helps keep the body away from the wheels or the wheels away from the body. like that, that's too tight. It's got a bit of a bow in it. That's why I like the bigger diameter tubes because your bamboo canes usually got a bit of a bend in it. So although it's the right diameter there, when you allow for the bend, it's rubbing against the bodywork. Or against the tubes. It's not going to run quite as freely as I'd like it to. I think I might have to use tape. It's not going to be as free running as it should be. If you can see the way the axle is bending, it's rubbing against the tubes. I found my band, so I've even got three already joined so together there. Straighter, which looks like about the right length. So my idea is. Squeeze that through there, I'll hold it in place, and on the back I'm just going to wrap it around so it goes over itself, and that holds it in place. Let's see if it works.
Right. Right, we need some rubber bands. Right, the cardboard wheels probably won't have much grip, so we might have to add some weight to help them grip. But we'll give it a try first. Well, I think that was good enough. I didn't wind it up very far. Summary time, that actually worked better than I expected. I didn't need to add any weight to help the wheels grip. And we did the full length, which is about eight meters we do there. So summary, cardboard, cardboard, cardboard. So chassis or body made out of cardboard, wheels cut out of cardboard, bamboo canes, barbecue skewers for the axles paper drinking straw for the axle tubes. Uh, I super glued them in place. I use super glue for everything, but I also put some sticky tape over them just in case the super glue didn't hold them well enough. And on the insides of the wheels, we've got extra bits of cardboard just to give us a bit of extra thickness. It helps them uh, grip the axle. That's it. Job done.